dirt cheap. And then they want like four bucks for more blades for one. So you can get the double-edged safety razor blades for like 10 cents. Expensive ones are 25 cents each. Supposedly they last a lot longer. It's gonna be my first time ever using one. First thing I'm gonna do is a little long, so I'm gonna take it down. the YouTube videos I watched was saying they recommend all these different types of barber gel, fancy shave lotions. Two I got, Gillette Shave and the good old standby Barber Saw. We're gonna go with the Barber Saw. Some of the videos said to hold the razor 30 degrees, some said 45. So I'm assuming it's gonna be somewhere in between the two. I just gotta find it. They did say you don't push on them when you're shaving like you do with regular ones. So where the blades are so much cheaper when you're buying a double-edged safety razor, it's gonna be better for the environment. Okay, I'm letting the blade do the work. One of the videos I watched said when you got a lot, you're not looking to take it all off in the first whack. You're just going to get most of it off and then you can get a baby smooth with the second, sometimes a third go around. I might have to do a few more go arounds where it's my first time using grandpa's style razor. Now the one I'm using today, I'll link to it in the description below. There's a lot of them on Amazon. This one was $11.99. Came with a few blades and also a travel case with a mirror. I figured I'd go with the cheap one, see if I like this style. This one should work, right? Okay, now I gotta go with the grain. Keep the skin tight. I never think about shaving, but this is my first time doing it this style. Okay, I know I gotta get the chin again and some other areas but I'm gonna wipe it off. My initial impressions, the double-edged safety razor is a lot slower, but granted, it's my first time ever using one, and honestly, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm putting on a lot more shaving cream than I normally do. Good thing Barbasol is so cheap. Okay, I'm gonna go at it again. The cheek is feeling really smooth. It's my chin and neck that I'm struggling to get the right angle on. I'm talking fine because I gotta keep my skin tight when I use this. I have another one too, which we'll try out, but today we're just using this one. The other one has a little bit longer handle. Once I get the method down, I'm thinking I might prefer a longer handle. The link to the one I bought if you want to check it out, I left the link to Amazon down, in the, down below. You can go and check out the one I got. We're going for round three now. My cheeks are feeling pretty good. Now this will go faster using a double-edged straight safety razor once you got practice, right? But getting this neck area to one of these is totally new to me. It's supposed to go with the grain, but don't rush it. That's what a lot of the video said. Well, it feels a lot better, Mr. Patch. It's not totally smooth. A lot of it though is my style. This is where we do different stuff to get a thumbnail. Every time I have facial hair then I shave. Reminds me of how much I look like my dad. Tiny bit there that'll come right off. The Hitler area right up in here. This chin though is not as smooth as I want it. Ding, ding, ding. We're going to do one more round. I know they say for a lot of people, shave will take a little bit longer than using one like this. But once you get it down, it should work a lot better. And I push. Push out of habit. I just know I'm going to cut myself in this last little go around. Focus. And the handle, when I first started, I thought I'd want a longer handle than what I got. But once I started using it, I don't know if I'd want a longer handle. I'm going to try out the other one to see, but this one makes it easy to maneuver. I like it. 
If I wasn't in here filming, I'd be focused more on it. I'd be listening to some podcasts on YouTube. I got rolling, rolling. It's not perfect. There's a little bit down here on the chin, you know? Think it's oh, I like it. That was one blade, and it's still good to go. When I have a lot of hair like I did today, I use like a three or four blade, use it. If I gotta swap out another one, I usually gotta use two to three of these. It'll be a lot better once I get it down. 